Hello everyone, today we are back at Buckland level crossing which looks a little bit different to what it did in the video in the video that I posted in 2021 of it. So gone are the Griswold barriers, we've now got two Western Cullen Hayes barrier mechanisms on either side of the crossing as you can see. And we've got seven sets of Western Cullen Hayes LED lights and six Western Cullen Hayes e-bells. Yes, six e-bells. Personally, I think that six is a bit overkill. Personally, I think that six e-bells is a bit overkill for this level crossing, but that's just me nitpicking though. We've got another set of Western Cullen Hayes lights there. Another e-bell there. And then if I take off the tripod, we've got another e-bell over there and another one here. As well as, another, as well as two sets of Western Cullen Hayes lights. So the biggest change at, at this level crossing is these pedestrian gates they've added in. So yeah, and they, and uh, and unlike and unlike most of the other level crossings that I've filmed, that that I've unlike most of the other level crossings that I've filmed that have these gates, these ones actually have a gate release button. So. So yeah, this gate here, it's actually high enough that, that, that what's the name, I just can't reach over with my hand and push it in. However though, if we come in here, I push the button, orange light comes on, and that releases the gate. Now if I shut the gate again, it should go out. Yep, there it goes. And that's the gate locked back, and that and that's the gate locked back into place. To place so, yeah. There's not really much else to see here. So if that's said and done, let's now go and wait for a train, or some trains, I should say.